Hey guys, welcome back to my Undertale pacifist run. Usually I wouldn't start it in the load screen, but the music is different here than it's ever been for me before, probably because I'm doing a pacifist run. It's nice and cheerful. And we've also got a happy Toriel sitting in her chair there. That bit has always just been blank for me, so I think it's great that it's a lovely, lovely neat little easter egg kind of thing. I just thought I'd show that bit. Anyway, we are in Snowden. We made it to Snowden. Uh, how much gold do we have? Probably not much. 162 actually, not bad. What are you selling? Ooh, we can get a new... No, we don't need a new weapon, we need new armor, that's it. Uh, should we get that? Let's get the bandana. And... Wait, what? Oh. So they both heal 22? Hmm. Or maybe there's like two of them there or something. I think this is probably the best one. Let's just buy one of those. There we go. And none of them ever, ever buy stuff from you. <laughs> okay, so item manly bandana. We'll equip that. What did we get rid of? The bandage, yeah. Let's just put that in a chest. The box, sorry. Uh, there we go. Now we've just got recovery items in there, which is great. What was in the inn? Alright, we can stay there if we want. I've never stayed there before. I don't think we have to. So I'm not going to talk to everyone yet. We've got a little kid there that I'm sure we'll have to talk to at some point. Oh, this goes a lot faster if you don't talk to everyone. <laughs> There's the library. <laughs> Lovely. Got all these bones for sands, I think. And... That's papyruses. Look inside, yes, it's empty. Oh, that's quite sad. We can't get in because it's locked. Got the little hole secret passage, I think. Whoops. I didn't really want to go in there. <laughs> okay, great. Back through we go. <laughs> Could have skipped all this. There's a nice shed. Okay. Oh, it's getting cold. It's getting chilly. I probably should have saved after biting, buying all my stuff. Because now we come face to face with Papyrus. This is our first, like, proper boss fight, isn't it? Human, allow me to tell you about some complex feelings. Feelings like the joy of finding another pasta lover, the admiration for another's puzzle solving skills, the desire to have a cool, smart person think you are cool. These feelings, they must be what you are feeling right now. I can hardly imagine what it must be like to feel that way. After all, I am very great. I don't ever wonder what having lots of friends is like. I pity you, lonely human. Worry not, you shall be lonely no longer. I, the great Papyrus, will be your... Dot dot. No. No, this is all wrong. I can't be your friend. You are a human. I must capture you. Then I can fulfill my lifelong dream. Powerful, popular, prestigious. That's Papyrus. The newest member of the Royal Guard. Bring it, Papyrus. Okay. Whew. So, we won't have spare yet, so we'll have to talk to him, I guess. I guess we'll try flirting with him. Insulting doesn't seem like it would be good. What? F flirting? So you finally reveal your ultimate feelings. Well, I'm a skeleton with very high standards. Um, I can make spaghetti. Oh no! You're meeting all my standards! <laughs> I guess this means I have to go on a date with you? Let's date later, after I capture you. Okay. Papyrus is thinking about what to wear for his date. Can I spare him yet? That would be great. Do I flirt with him again? Oh no. Let's date later, after I capture you. Um... I don't know what i do. I don't want to insult him, do I? He's thinking about what to cook for his date. I'll try and flirt a bunch. He flirt, but to no avail. Seems acting won't escalate this battle. That's very useful that it tells me that. <laughs> so I guess I have to fight now. I don't want to have to fight him. Dab some bone cologne behind his ears. Let's fight him then. So you're serious. Then, let's see if you can handle my fabled blue attack. I can. It is easy to handle your fabled blue attack. I 
seem to remember Papyrus' attack being really difficult. Yeah. Uh, his fight being really difficult. You're blue now. That's my attack. <laughs> You're blue now. So I guess I have to fight him, but I don't want to fight him, I just want to spare him. I wonder what I should wear. Oh shit. Oh, this is going to be really hard because I don't have that much health. Oh my god. Okay. So maybe I do need to bet get the 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 stronger weapon. So I can do more damage and get to the the mercy bit sooner. Really knowing that you do have to fight in a pacifist run. What? I'm not thinking about that date thing. He is still thinking about it, so that's good. So I think I'm doing the right thing here. His attacks are so hard later though. Cute juice, nice. Die. Yeah, don't make me use my special attack. Fuck. I think I'll need to go buy the weapon. Traction slime, wow. Because that way I can kind of get through the fights quicker. Ooh. I knew that one was coming. <laughs> oh my god, I'm not doing like any damage. Uh. Realizes he doesn't have ears, oh no! <laughs> After all that dabbing. Unparalleled spaghetti spaghetti. Ow. Holy shit, 5 HP. I need to heal. He remembered a bad joke. Good. Let's have some monster candy, I guess. Oh, sweet, that's only 10. That's good. Undine will be really proud of me. That's great. I don't know how to avoid that one. Or like any of these. I have to heal again. <laughs> Holy shit. The king will trim a hedge in the shape of my smile. That's great, Papyrus. Oh no. Arc. I'm not even like halfway done this fight, oh my god. That was an easy one. Yeah. Let me spare you. I don't want to fight you, Papyrus. I just want to date the shit out of you. <laughs> nope, still can't spare. Yeah, I definitely need to get the weapon. Will anyone like me as sincerely as you? No. I am the only one who will like you, Papyrus. We belong together, obviously. Uh, uh. Stop hurting me. He's rattling his bones. Someone like you is really rare. I'm only at like half health, holy shit. I've only got him at like half health. Oh my god. Let's have bicycle. You want half the bicycle. Great. And dating might be kind of hard. Oh god, I didn't need to move. That should have been a really easy one. He prepares a non-bone attack that spends a minute fixing his mistake. I hope I'm not wasting my time fighting him. After your capture and sent away. Or just don't send me away then. Oh, that was close. Let's have the unicycle. 11 HP, great. Ugh, who cares? Give up! I won't! Although I'm taking a lot of damage. A lot of damage. He's trying hard to play it cool. Pow! I need to survive for a long enough time. Give up or face my special attack. God, his special attack is brutal. <laughs> okay, that's the ice cream. Uh, the nice cream, sorry. 
very soon I'll lose my special attack. Well, I'm not even sure I'll live to see your special attack, Papyrus. I think you're just supposed to do enough damage to him. And that's when he pulls out a special attack, and I'm certainly not doing very much damage to him. Okay. Ow, 28 damage. It's your last chance before a special attack. I just don't think I'm going to live to your special attack, mate. Here we go, bring it on. Behold my special attack. Nom, nom, nom. What the heck? That's my special attack. Hey, you stupid dog. Do you hear me? Stop munching on that bone. Hey, what are you doing? Come back here with my special attack. Oh well. I'll just use a really cool regular attack. Please let me spare you. <laughs> He's getting ready for a really cool regular attack. Here's an absolutely normal attack. It's still a pretty tough attack, Papyrus. I've got two health, Papyrus. Okay, this is like the... Wow. You're too weak, I was easily able to capture you. I will now send you to the capture zone. Or, as Sans calls it, a garage? You're in the doghouse now. Nah, wait, was I supposed to lose to him? I think I was. <laughs> Fuck, that means I wasted all those healing things. Oh, God. Oh, well. That's probably fine. Okay, so now I'm supposed to go to his house. It's locked. How am I supposed to... I'm supposed to go to... Ah! So it looks like if I... So I did just lose to him there. But it looks like if I lose to him three times he will just skip our fight. So if I just let myself get taken down to 1 HP two more times, he should just skip our fight completely. And then we can move on to the next bit. There we are, we're down to one. Well, you may have cleverly escaped from jail before, but this time I've upgraded the facilities. Not only will you be trapped, but you won't even want to leave. <laughs> It's not upgraded at all. Escaping again. Back down to one again. You are persistent, but it just won't work on me. I am the persistentist. And if you think you are persistentister, that is wrong. Grammatically wrong. <laughs> because the correct form would be not as persistentist as the virus, the persistentistist. <laughs> Jesus Christ. I hope you enjoyed this lesson. <laughs> I did, it was a good lesson. So are we done now? Possibly? Still locked. Okay, I think we just have to go see him one more time. We'll see what he says this time. I do wish I hadn't wasted all those uh, items. Oh well. Whatever, you know. I've still got Monster Candy in my, my box. You're back again? I finally realized the true reason why. You just miss seeing my face so much. I'm not sure I can fight someone who feels this way, but mostly I'm getting really tired of capturing you. Fight Papyrus? No. Okay. I guess I'll accept my failure. Sweet. Didn't have to fight him. No. -hoo -hoo. I can't even stop someone as weak as you. Undine's going to be disappointed in me. I'll never join the Royal Guard, and my friend Quantity will remain stagnant. What should you say? Let's be friends. Really? You want to be friends with me? Well then, I guess. I guess I can make an allowance for you. Wowee! We haven't even had our first date. And I've already managed to hit the friend zone. <laughs> Good job, Papyrus. Who knew that all I needed to make pals was to give people awful puzzles and then fight them? <laughs> you taught me a lot, human. I hereby grant you permission to pass through. And I'll give you directions to the service. Continue forward until you reach the end of the cavern. Then, when you reach the capital, cross the barrier. That's the magical seal trapping us all underground. Anything can enter through it, but nothing can exit. Except someone with a powerful soul. 
like you. That's why the king wants to acquire a human. He wants to open the barrier with soul power. Then us monsters can return to the surface. Oh, I must forgot to tell you. To reach the exit, you will have to pass through the king's castle. The king of all monsters, he is. Well, he's a big fuzzy pushover. Everybody loves that guy. I am certain if you just say, Excuse me, Mr. Dreamer, can I please go home? He'll guide you right to the barrier himself. Anyway, that's enough talking. I'll be at home being a cool friend. Feel free to come by and have that date. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> that was weird. Okay, let's go have that date. That is, that is a necessary thing to do, I think. Plus, I've never left him alive before. Oh, hello. So you came back to have a date with me. You must be really serious about this. I'll have to take you someplace really special. A place I like to spend a lot of time. Here we go. Not the library. Not near these two losers. Oh god, it is near these two losers. Is it here? <laughs> Amazing. My house. Oh, okay. Yeah, I can see inside their house. Awesome. Uh, what's going on in there? This is my brother's pet rock. He always forgets to feed it. As usual, I have to take responsibility. The rock is covered in sprinkles. That's nice. Uh, sorry, what is... Whoa, what? What? How weird. Impressed, I increased the height of my sink. I can fit more bones under it. Take a look-see. There's a dog in there. What? Catch that meddling canine. Curses. <laughs> So he's just playing music in there or something. Sans! Stop plaguing my life with incidental music. Okay, great. Fantastic stuff. Welcome to scenic my house. Enjoy and take your time. So do I just have to like check everything out or something? That's my room. If you finish looking around, we could go in and do whatever people do when they date. Go inside? Yes. Oh, look at this. Oh, he's got a cool racing car bed. That's my bed. <laughs> if I ever get to the surface, I'd like to drive down a long highway. Wind in my hair. Sun on my skin. Of course, that's just a dream. So instead I cruise while I snooze. Fantastic. Hello, this is Papyrus. How did I get this number? It was easy. I just dialed every number sequentially until I got yours. Yeah. <laughs>